In this video, we will set up the security for the Gate.io account. After doing the registration, also the KYC verification, now we will proceed with setting up the security. And that includes the Google Authenticator settings. So while in my profile, I'll go to security settings. And currently, these are off also the SMS verification. If I want to set up the anti phishing code, what it does is it prevents you or it helps you to identify whether an email is a phishing attack or an actual email coming from I.O. So we will set this up later on, but now let's proceed with this Google Authenticator. I'll click this turn on. Step one obviously is to have the Google Authenticator in your phone. You can have also other apps like the Authy as long as it scans the code and it can store two FA codes. From here, either scan this code or enter this key or characters manually. But better to scan this. I won't be able to show my actual app because it's not allowed to be recorded. Instead, I'll just the add account and then scan the code. And then from there, I'll just name that as IO. From here, you need to enter two codes. The one from the email and also from the Google 2FA. The email should look like this. I'll enter this code. Next is the Google Authenticator code and hit confirm. So we have now the Google to FA set up. Just in case that you want to turn this off or you want to change this, you can do so by clicking this unbind. Now we can also set up the SMS verification just in case that you lose your access to Google to FA or email. One way to verify your account is perhaps through this SMS verification. I'll turn this on as well. Let's see if this will ask all this three whenever you log in if this is turned on. Next, I'll enter my phone number here. And I'll just click send for the SMS code as well as for the email. Next, proceed entering all the codes you receive. And also from the Google 2 FA. Hit confirm. And it's completed. Now let's proceed to the anti fission code. I'll turn this on. Next, I enter here the code or the fission code. What will happen is every time I receive an email from Gate.io, it will show up this code as well. If this doesn't include that code or it doesn't match at all, it means that it's not coming from Gate.io. It could be a phishing attack. To finalize this, enter the code from the Google Authenticator and then hit confirm. So that's how quick, easy it is to set up the Google Authenticator, the SMS verification, as well as the anti vision code. Also, here in advanced settings, you can update the login to step verification currently. 2FA is required every time I log in. Also, if I want to update some settings here, especially for the withdrawal wall, I can do so. We also have a font password here. What happens is every time I do the withdrawal wall or maybe transferring my font from Gate.io to other exchange or wallet, it will ask for another set of password, which is the font password. I can set this up. I already have the code or the password here. I'll just enter here the Google 2FA again. Hit confirm and it's successful. So I already have all the securities that I need set up here in Gate.io. If you want to update some here, like for the advanced and the password management, you can do so by going to your profile and then security settings. And that's it. For other tutorial videos about Gate.io, you might as well check the videos below. Hopefully this helps you. And thank you for watching. See you on the next videos. Bye-bye.